In other news, the gist of the game at this year's Busan Mobility Show is going green with electric vehicles and making them more accessible to the general public. Our reporter Moon ae went there and follows this report. The Busan International Mobility Show is one of the country's biggest motor events and it's the first time that it's been rebranded from the Busan International Motor Show featuring other modes of transport such as urban air mobility vehicles and autonomous driving boats. But cars remain in the spotlight with several new releases on the press day prior to the event opening to the public on Friday. With electric vehicles becoming increasingly more popular, the new reveals at this year's show are centered around more affordable and accessible models, such as this car behind me. Hyundai Motor showcased its Casper electric model for the first time to meet the demand for low-cost EVs following its success with the Ioniq 5 and 6. The popularization of EVs will only become possible if anyone can enjoy the various experiences that they provide easily and at a reasonable cost. So today we unveil the new standard for the EV era, the Casper Electric. Another car designed for the everyday driver is its new all-electric Mini Cooper, an electric version of its classic Mini Cooper model. Fitted with OLED display screens from Samsung Display, the British automotive brand has put a modern twist on its traditional circular dash that's also paired with voice-activated controls. Luxury vehicle brand Genesis Motor also unveiled its newly minted electrified G80, which features several new aspects that elevate the experience for both driver and passenger. A single button enables the driver to open and close the fuel door without needing to get their hands dirty, and the vehicle itself is bigger to give more room in the back. Due to the new design of the wheel, which made improvements to drag force, crucial for EVs, the new electrified G80 can now go around 475 kilometers on one charge, nearly 50 kilometers more than the former model. BMW also presented its high-end cars, the new high-performance M4 model, as well as the all-electric new iX2. But the scale of the Busan International Mobility Show has declined over the past few years, with the number of visitors falling by around 27 percent over the last eight years, alongside a slowdown in the EV industry. Consumers are now familiar with EVs, so they know what they want to look for in terms of features and price. This means that there's more of a monopoly in the market where popular EVs are doing well and others aren't. With the event now focusing on more interactive booths as opposed to new releases to enable a more hands-on experience for visitors and showing other future mobility trends, eyes are on whether this could change the face of the show. Moon Heryeon, Arirang News, Busan.